Hi, my name is Mel and I am a dental hygienist here at Expressions Dental. Today I'm going to be talking to you about diabetes in relation to periodontal disease. Diabetes is a group of metabolic diseases and it is characterized by high blood glucose levels and also the ability to produce insulin. Gum disease is a lesser known complication of diabetes. There are different forms of gum disease. First of all, there's gingivitis and then there's also periodontitis. Periodontitis can be apparent in either mild, moderate, or severe. When diabetes is poorly managed, it can lead to or accelerate periodontal disease in children and also in adults. Higher than normal blood glucose levels can also lead to higher glucose levels in saliva as well, which prepares a very fertile breeding ground for bacteria in the mouth. This can raise the risk of dental decay in the mouth and also gum disease. Some of these symptoms may include swollen red and tender gums, loose teeth, recession around the teeth where the gums have kind of pulled back to expose root surfaces, and also bad breath. Gingivitis can usually be averted by your dentist and also by following an at-home care program. Periodontitis, however, is a little bit different. Because there's so much bone and gum degradation, you need to see the dentist and dental hygienist a little bit more regular. Depending upon the level of your periodontal disease, um, your hygienist might want to see you every three to four months for a deeper cleaning and also to make sure that gum and bone health are always at their optimal best. For more information, visit us online at expressionsdental.ca or give us a call here at the office. The number is 403-252-7733 and one of the girls at the front will be more than happy to book you in to see the hygienist.